Hey, hello everyone. Welcome back to Surviving Mars. I'm Afro Luigi. We are progressing very slowly now. <laughs> We're almost on the tech tree. Uh... Yeah, we're almost done the tech tree. We are probably going to have to build a molehole because our electronic... Sure, we're having an issue with our electronics. Actually, no. Um, actually, not electronics with the metal, but the metal will resolve itself fairly soon. Because, yeah, we're just waiting... Yeah, we're building our mining dome up here. And take advantage of those deep rare metals. Oh, that's what's going on. <laughs> We're out of, also out of fuel because I've been using my rockets too much. Oh boy. We have a food shortage. How? Oh, that's why. That's how. Right, we don't have a. Um... Yeah, that's an issue. Let us. Bring you, have you bring some food down here. Actually, no, 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 no. We should have you load. Research complete. Oh, it's resolving itself. Okay. There. Oh, wait, no. I, I'm going to cross just so I can start tallying my way through this. And we're almost done that. Only four more rows left? Well, at least the shuttle, the rocket's done its thing. Oh! That's what we could use the water for. Fueled extractors, that's not a bad idea. Gonna need to bring some concrete up though. Yeah, my next load I'll bring up a load of concrete and we'll set up some fueled extractors. Oh, what's going on? Got a tag here. Oh. Alert, something is wrong. All data transfers from Earth have ceased after an explosion rocked our colony. Several colonists have been killed. Our experts have begun fixing the data as we speak. However, preliminary analysis of the problem suggested a sabotage from our rivals here on Mars. Because of the technical difficulties we are experiencing, it'll cost us further research to name the culprit. Yes, fix the problem, but also find out who is responsible. We must know our enemies. A colonist has died. It's not like I need the outsourcing right now. Like we're producing like yeah, six point four K on our own. I think we're running out of, um, we're not running out of, um, waste rocks, so why isn't that doing anything? I'll crank out another 20. Resources are low. Destroyed vehicles. Oh, it's probably this thing here, cold machines. Several columns were injured today. The severity of their injuries varying in accidents that all involved drones. Because of the time frame in which the accidents happened is rather small, the ensuing quick investigation found software corruption in all the involved drones. Corruptions are in your say can only happen if our system was hacked. Although an obvious act of sabotage, we can't prove who is to blame precisely. What we can do is raise the issue to Earth's judicial bodies, which will probably hinder all of our rivals, not just the guilty ones' operations for a short while. Of course we're going to ring the bell on that. Screw them. After all the trading we've done with them. Oh, I did notice. I was kind of looking around. Like, we can see grass is spawning well away. There's even tiny... Where was it? I thought I saw a tiny... Oh, there it is. The tiny patch of grass all on its lonesome up here. So it's, it's spreading. Not naturally, though, but it's spreading.
Oh, you're almost full and ready to go back to Earth, but you guys have no fuel whatsoever. So yeah, that's what we're, we're going to have to do that. We're going to have to uh, set up some fuel industry up on Crichton. And we'll start producing fuel. Then we can bring the fuel back to Earth. So we're going to need a concrete deep, not a concrete depot, a fuel depot. And we'll have, we'll open that up. This way, when we start producing fuel, it'll keep a stockpile of tin up here, but the rest we can take back to uh, Mars with us. Oh, you don't need, we don't need night shift on for these guys. How's the population doing? Oh, oh, we're having a, we're, it's, the population boom is going to start happening down here too. So, bursts are forbidden for one fuel. We're going to try to prevent the overpopulation crisis. I went off camera, I went and turned that on for all the surface domes as well. Oh, right, that's going to take forever as well. Um, yeah, that is low priority. That's fine. What's going on over here? Unemployed and homeless. Well, that's going to correct we itself. Down there again? Yeah, because of the lack of food deliveries. Okay. And the plus side, we have lots of food. Because we've definitely come through on the other side of this. Because look at that. That's 200 some. So, let us go over here and crank these back up to 100 then. So I think I turned them down to, oh, down to 40. Research complete. Oh, plasma cutters. It's another tech done. We're only now researching deep water extraction. Is there a lot of deep water? I don't think so. Yeah, there's just the four deep water deposits. Oh, I can pack these up now. Oh, I did not realize that thing had such a long range. This is a micro dome. It doesn't need. I delete that. Do I keep the prefab? Hopefully. Yes, I do. So we're going to stick the prefab here. And it's also going to need life support. Is there water over here? No. Oh well, we have the we have the technology. Moisture evaporator there. Toxic rains. Oh, we're going to have toxic... Oh, there we are. Our first toxic pool right here. There's probably going to be a few more. I think I see one over here. Yep, toxic pool right there. So we're going to have to send our, our RC generator around to clean those up. In a, we'll wait for the rainstorm to pass. Even our underground is not providing us with a lot of fuel. It's all going up top, I imagine.
And we'll have to build a dumping site here. Yeah, we're gonna need a mole hole eventually. I'll keep the mole hole over here as well. Probably slap it down over here. Actually, we have a. Uh, before I forget that experiment, the Zocorp rovers up there. Let's bring it down. It'll provide cover to this little outpost here. Actually, no, a mole hole we want covered with turrets. We don't want to use the rover. Uh, oh, that's not the wonder tab. I have researched, but we have. Uh. You know what? It's worth it. Let's start construction. It only needs 40 to power it, so a single advanced sterling generator will do the trick. We'll build two, though. Because we're also going to slap down some turrets. We want it heavily protected. We have a con uh yeah, okay. You know what? Oh, don't waste the fuel, no, but upgrade it for amplify it. Is there any other concrete depots we can slap down to make this go quicker? Yes. Oh, did I see another... Ooh, I have another automatic medical extractor. Where to put it? There. We need all the metals, because we are in the... It's a metal crisis. We're in the middle of a metal crisis. Let's just be straight up about it. We're also very short on polymers, but that will be self-correcting soon as well. Microgy mining operations, that's on. Hmm. Alright, let's go up to. What's Crichton up to? Oh, you're almost full, so, uh. Oh no, you're nowhere near full, but I want to bring some concrete back so we can get some fuel production. So we can take advantage of the fuel up here, because we want. I want to slap fueled extractor onto these satellites up here. Well, onto a uh, crate, and I want some fuel extractors up here. Yeah, this is going to be a long time for... Oh, we don't even have the uh, exotic min minerals minerals for that, do we? No, we don't. Um, hmm. Resources are low. Yeah, <laughs> you're... Just in, actually, oh, you're short on polymers. <laughs> that would do it. You're also, we're really short on polymers.
Are you done? No, you're not even done yet. You're getting there, but you're not. Let's slap up. Let's increase the speed. Because now we're just waiting for things to get produced. Oh, we can uh, start cleaning up some toxic pools now. Okay, that one's done. Where are there more? I should have done this earlier, but... Yeah, I should have done this during the day. <laughs> oh, I know what you're going to need up here. It's interesting. It claims we have 10 polymers, but where are they? Are they all down here? Wait, did I have... I have two polymer factories up here. Man, we need to stop using our polymers. Yet. Yeah, because that's not getting any maintenance. That only needs one more, thankfully. On the other hand, I was thinking of powering that with nuclear energy, but on the other hand, to do that, I need polymers. <laughs> uh. Research complete. Oh, advanced. We can now build mining stations in orbit. Not that we're ever going to. Oh, the Megadome is built. <sighs> that requires polymers. You know what? Hmm. You know, I'm just going to have to leave you off, I think. I will slap. Resources are low. Yeah, I'll leave that dome off for now. I'll wait for the polymers to spread out. We um we need a way we need a bunch of people to die off is what we need right now actually. On the other hand, our first wonder is being built. What's going on underground? Oh, another seed vegetation project. Oh, Vicky arrived. Resources are low. Come on, let me select you. There we go. Now, are you done? Yes, you are. Next toxic pool is. Is that a toxic pool? Oh, that's grass. Looks like our next toxic pool is down here. Go clean that up. Research that's a complete. big one. Deep water extraction is done. You know what? Let's slap that up. Let's get rid of Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. We solved one problem and we're immediately on to a new one. On the other hand, it's getting built. I was hoping I wouldn't be able, I wouldn't have to do the mole hole, but it's just too handy. Plus we have lots of concrete rolling in. We are probably gonna need a couple more of these guys down here. Yeah. That's going to be done in no time. Our polymers are finally... Oh, that got maintenance. Oh. Oh no. 
Well, uh, you guys aren't busy. Pair that. You know, once Research complete. Yeah, I'll keep going with the uh doing things in order of rows. Our drones are invincible, but our rovers are not. So what's next for polymers? Those that thing needs five polymers. What else needed polymers? Something else needed polymers. Oh right. I wanted those powered with advanced sterling generators, and that requires polymers. <laughs> There's no winning, is there? On the plus side, the polymers are rolling in. The mole hole is almost complete. The issue is going to be powering the mole holes. Oh, well, that one's over halfway. Meteor incoming. <laughs> uh. Oh yeah, you're repaired. Yeah, so actually, if for time efficiency, it's probably quicker to go there for going down there. Visit asteroid. We're, we're sending you back to Crichton. Visit asteroid. You're not going to take any polymers. Uh, yeah. Oh, Mars only has seven. Yeah, sure, we'll load up on ten. Actually, let's load up on five. There. Uh, twenty concrete actually should do the trick. Funding received. More funding. Just we're at twenty four point seven billion. I don't think funding's an issue. Asteroid Behemoth. What a name. Man, the crop quality is not going up on our uh, open farm. It makes sense that this one's going to, the quality up here is going to increase this less because we're not actually using lichen, I think is what it's called. Yeah. We're, we're skipping straight to grass up here, so it has to, um, Research complete. it basically has to grow naturally. Oh, only uh, 4.9 polymers needed. Oh, 2.9. Oh, Vicky already arrived at Crichton. All right, let's do this. We want micro G water extractors. Slap you down. We're probably not going to have enough power for this right off the bat. We should probably build another solar array. Actually, now you're too close to the micro G extractor. You're going to get dusty if we do it like that. How far? Hmm. Now, let's just use regular solar panels. Because space is starting to become an issue up here. Now, we are also going to need 
a fuel refinery. We'll set it up near the stockpiles. Actually, it does it is? We do seem to have enough power, so. We have enough uh, machine parts to upgrade everything. Hmm. We also are going to want... <laughs> you know what? We may as well just slap a large water tank in here. Mostly for the walls. I don't think we're ever... Uh, that's that's going to be too much. As, as funny as that would be, that's going to be too much. Research complete. Oh, microfusion's researched. All right. Ooh. Or you need to bring some electronics up so soon. Yeah. Mm. Yeah, we're gonna need to bring, we're gonna bring some electronics up. Everything up here is gonna be amplified. Actually, this, yeah, if if we want to export fuel back to Earth, that's gonna need to be amplified. We'll leave it with just the one for now. When that thing gets fully extracted, we'll build other fuel things. I want to see if a single one. A single micro G water extractor fully upgraded can provide enough fuel, uh, water, to keep this thing going. Perfect, just like that. It's providing one. It's only produce fully upgraded. It produces one. Oh, it's because it's there's no, no there's no water going into the tank. Once the uh, water tower is built, then we'll know. Just like that. There. What is its full output? Right now, it's 8.8. .8, so that's more than enough. But of course, that's not a depleted deposit. So next trip we're up, we're going to have to bring a bunch of electronics. Uh, plan your return to Mars. Request. All right. Once you're back, let's go. Let's go, anything new underground? Underground earthquakes. Building's not working. Dome without life support. Oh, that one's built finally. All right. Yeah, we're just gonna turn that off. So we're not gonna. We don't need it yet. We're future proofed. Oh, yeah. Um, you know what? Simple solution. There we go. Molehole is active. Is this a dormant rain or is this toxic rain? Nope. No idea. Yeah, 
Anyways, what's our polymer looking like? Still, still disturbingly low. Does this dome have life support yet at least? Or almost going to have life support? No. No sign of any life support in that way. So, this place is also going to need life support, though. You know what? We're going to do something we haven't used in a while. I'm going to use a wind farm. Just a couple, just enough to get this thing up and running and to get us more polymers. But that's going to be for the next episode. I will see you guys then. Bye.